Hey Libra, welcome back to your quick read for today. This is your tarot and oracle card reading with me, Empress Meek. I'm sending you a multitude of love, light, and positive energy. This is our new baby channel. It is growing rapidly and I'm grateful for everything you guys have been doing and all the love you've been showing me. Thank you, Libra. Um, Libra, let's get into your messages and see what spirit has for you today. Hold on, cards are flying everywhere. I feel like you have been expressing yourself to somebody. Let's see what's going on here. Spirit, thank you so much for bringing me here with my Libras. Thank you for all you do in the divine realm and all the blessings you bestow upon us each and every day. Thank you for giving us victory in all the situations we may face and giving us abundance and overflow and clarity to keep balance in every situation we have in our lives. All right, amen. All right, Libra, let's go ahead and get into your reading for Libra Spirit lightning so you got something happening really really fast oh libra control your temper or you will be sorry so control your anger all right and this is saying um if you're patient a wish will be granted okay and then we have ink pot problems to be solved so don't worry libra if you just stay balanced and just hold your temper Things will definitely come to a resolve here, whatever this situation is. I feel like somebody is kind of pushing you. You know, you're quiet. You're doing your best to be resilient. But they, I mean, even as ignorant as this person may seem to you, Libra, you're not saying anything, okay? You're trying to hold it in, all right? I see that very clearly here, okay? Something could have, it could have something to do with the fair-skinned man um, or a man with white hair, gray hair, or blonde hair, all right? This could be an older guy brown eyes you know it doesn't have to be fair skin but any of these characteristics could be him it could be somebody with gray hair i feel like this person is getting on your nerves they're doing something here let's get into it libra i want to know i know you want to know honey mm -hmm. yes i hope you guys are feeling good thank you so much for remembering to like our videos helping our channel get out there you guys are so amazing i appreciate you all right so let's get into it libra what in the heck is going on here Who's bothering my Libra? Let's see. Spirit, show me clear messages so I can help. Oh, soulmate. Your soulmate love, accepts, and respects you. So for some of you Libras, um, a wish is granted. You're getting your soulmate here. And this person love, respects, and accepts you, okay? For some of you, you're wishing for a soulmate, a partner that is going to give you an equal give and take and be balanced with you, you know? You in it for the win, Libra, and for the long haul. You need somebody that's in it with you or just go ahead on. Rejection. So this man here could have made you feel rejected, even if this is a friend, a family member. Love. For a lot of you, I feel like this is love and this is some type of soulmate connection here. I feel like you feel rejection from this person. This could be another Libra, okay? I feel like this is some type of twin flame soulmate thing. And this man or whoever is making you feel rejected libra this could be you here as the man let's see and you can have blonde hair self-care clearly okay so clear your energy field and focus on yourself before acting so this is something that will help you hold your temper all right before you go off on this person honey because i feel it boiling let's see let's get a little bit more all right we're gonna get some more from another deck we're gonna leave this here underneath the bottom Leap of faith is it is safe for you to make the move you're considering. I feel like you're considering leaving this joker out in the cold or this female. It could be a male or a female. Okay, Libra, this could be you. And this could be a female that you're dealing with with rejection. All right. Um, or it could be vice versa. Remember, these are general guys. So if you need a personal, you can always email me. Okay, my information is in the description box. So let's see if we can get some feelings on this. What's the feeling surrounding Libra in this situation? Besides Libra trying not to go off, okay? You're trying to do the fair thing. You're trying to do what will be balanced for everybody. Like, and just, even if it means you just don't say anything, you're doing your best not to, right? And Spirit says that's what you should do. Let's see. Soulmate. What's this soulmate energy surrounding Libra? Mm, this soulmate is feeling guilty. Um, this person is feeling guilty for sabotaging this connection. Somebody couldn't can control their um, sexual urges. And you see how I was just stumbling over my Somebody's a fast talker here. Somebody knows what to say. They real quick on their feet with it. You know, and you're, they get you in your head, all right? You know how you Libras are. But this is another Libra, and I'm a Gemini moon, so I already know about the air, and I'm 
baby i'm quick with it so this person is giving it to you it's just like you know dealing with this person and talking to them it's just you have to take a breath and sit back and listen because it's just like this person is got an answer for every day going thing and i don't even know them <laughs> this energy come on leave her what's this rejection about definitely feeling guilty rejection all right they made this uh, um whatever they did all right whatever they did that they feel guilty about which the tarot is about to tell us because we're going into the tarot next but this relationship got turned upside down they made this a an unstable relationship very unhealthy for you very unbalanced you know imbalanced and it made you feel uncomfortable this person i feel like this person had you guessing turned the relationship upside down going from stable secure knowing feeling good sharing investing together equally to everything opposite of that so this person left you in limbo bought a bunch of confusion had you confused about what happened here self-care let's see you burn time to clear your energy field loveys you can get some candles take some time away be guarded vulnerable you're vulnerable right now your heart was open to this person you were in a relationship and this person just oh destroy everything why you do that like gosh Libra is a decent person to be with. At least you know that everything was going to be balanced and fair. You know, you'll be taken care of. You take care of them. Nothing wrong with equal give and take. Golly. You would think it's a foreign language out here. I know. You ain't got to tell me. All right. So, leap of faith here. It is safe for you to make the move you're considering regarding this reunion. So, I feel like some of you, this person wants to um, reconnect with some of you. This person is sad. They feel bad because now, look, it's getting cold outside, baby. And you know one thing about you, you're reliable, honey. And this person will be eating good, feeling good, and comfortable. And I feel like that's not for everybody. And that's why Spirit is letting you know right here. Mm-hmm. They need to check this out. Yeah, and this all could have went. It's all going down now, Libra. Autumn is taking place right now. And if you have these orange leaves around your home, booyah. Mm-hmm. Let me know in the comments. Is it you? Hmm? But yeah, it's safe for you to do what you want to do. Because this unexpected storm is here. Something happened. Hmm. Let's get into it. Let's see. In this unexpected, I feel like this person coming back, shocking you, trying to get back with you or something. And you're looking at this person like, what made the change of heart all of a sudden? Like, why now? Let's put this to the side with this guilty, shameful looking person. Look at them. Chuh. Yeah, okay. I feel like you're not giving this person the same attention and love that you used to because you don't see them the same. You're doing your best to still be kind because you still are loving. You still care for them. You don't want anything to happen to them, but what? Okay, like, what do they think this is? Let's see what they think this is, Libra. Spirit, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestor Spirit, guys, thank you so much for being here with me for love and support and guidance and protection. Thank you for showing me clear messages for Libra. What does Libra want to know? And Libra also, rejection, this rejection is divinely, um, it's actually divine protection. So you should be glad, okay? Don't, don't feel like you're missing anything with this joker, okay? Yeah. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo energy. You could be dealing with a Virgo, some of you Libras. Um, but this is somebody who's stable and secure, somebody that is generally reliable, you know. And let's see, for Libra and this um, Queen of Pentacles, for some of you Libras, it could just be you in this um, energy. It doesn't have to be that you're a Virgo. You could just be well-established. You could have your own business. You could be working good for yourself or have good money or be um, in a job or a situation with longevity, and wealth, you know, green is representing the financial stability. Gold is representing the um, seniority, all right? So you're just doing really well for yourself right now. With whatever you're doing, however you're getting it, you're comfortable, okay? Yeah, and I feel like you're blocking off this person from getting any type of goodies or anything. Spirit is telling you, go ahead for it, all right? And for some of you, it's this person that rejected you. And, you, and they just, they made you so unhappy. They cut off the sex. They cut off the passion, the, the connecting, like it was, it was just everything stopped. And I feel like it's a karmic lesson to be learned here with the Wheel of Fortune. It's talking about karmic law, balancing, um, karma. So it's a lesson to be learned here. Yeah. And I'm feeling like somebody is definitely calling, being called to be strong, 
Libra, I feel like this person is being strong and you also are realizing that you're stronger than you thought when it comes to you um, um, and this person. Yeah, I feel like it's some double energy here. You feel like you're being strong because this person has addictions. Somebody has addictions. Show me the devil. Mm-hmm. Arguing. It's toxicity here. This person has toxic connections. And you decided, I do not want this. No. Mm, you put your foot down. Huh, justice is served. Look, you put ten of cups in reverse with this fire wand. For some of you Libras, I feel like for my females out there, you feel like this person has a fire wand. Like, like literally, like, no, not good for you. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Queen of Swords in reverse, Eight of Swords in reverse. You told this person off. Some of you Libras, mm, you cussed this person the hell out. I feel like some of y'all cussed this person out. Queen of Swords in reverse. You got off on this person. You got mad. Um, I feel like this <laughs> I feel like this person could have seen somebody you know. Maybe that's this Queen of Pentacles energy. Because this Queen of Pentacles could could have blocked this person and said, no, like I don't deal with you. Ten of Cups in reverse. No, you may uh uh. You ruined everything. It's like you ruined our family or something. That is funny. They somebody shut this person down. Look at this uh Queen of Pentacles energy. If this not I feel like this is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn blocking off um this person, this soulmate that's guilty, saying no. Mm -mm, and that's their karma. You ruined my family or something like that. You you know, they made you unhappy. So I feel like this person that you know, they saw this person or something like that. Show me, show me more energy on this Queen of Pentacles. Yep, she said, oh no. Whoever this was saw this person, ignored them, ignored them because they ruined this happiness for you. Yep, this person ignored them and said, oh, child, bye. We don't mess with you like that. Uh -huh. Page of Pentacles in reverse. No, right? <laughs> we don't I want you. That's what you told them. That's what that's the, this person have your back. Whoever this is, they seen this person and told this person, kick rocks, okay? Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wrap all right libra i'm so proud of you that's right because this person doesn't deserve you i feel like show me why this soulmate is guilty uh-huh explore other options in excess just doing all kinds of stuff um this person is this is showing me that not only were they trying to be strategic about how they were choosing their options they had all these options and some some of them it was right in your face they lied Mm-hmm. Good for them. Bye. Let's see. For my Libras, a self-affirmation card. Trust. All right. This is going to help you elevate and get out of your feelings. Trust. Take a chance. Faith can move mountains. Trust the universe to guide you through the unknown. Right? You're unsure of your future. You don't know what's going to happen. Some of you are a little bit older. You may um, not be sure if you're going to be able to settle down. Spirit is saying trust him. You can have which, whatever you want, Libra, as long as you believe you can. Ask and you shall receive. Right? All right, my wise, loving Libras. I will see you the next time. Thank you for your love and support. Don't forget to share our new channel with your fellow Libras, with our fellow Libras. And talk to me in the comments, lovies. I like to read your comments and I definitely will connect with you there. All right, loves. Bye. I love you and I mean it.